Ever tried to label some storm drainage structures in your profile and the labels come in the wrong spot and for the life of you, can, you can't figure out how to get them changed? Well, let's quickly go through how to change that and maybe get you working a little bit faster. So in this, I have a profile view, obviously, and some storm drainage pipes and structures. And let's just annotate it real fast. So I'm going to do the entire profile and I'll just choose this and we'll just use the default stuff that pops in. Now, notice that this style is set to have an offset and be vertical with a line, but it's hooked here in the middle. Well, I don't want it there. I want it hooked at the top. So you would think that you would drag it. And when I do that, I get into my drag state. I can get that far. But as soon as I leave the structure, I get into my drag state and now I can't do what I wanted to do. Well, let's go through how to real easily change this to hook to a different location. It's super easy. It's just buried in a location you wouldn't expect. You want to go to your tool space, go to settings and then pipe network, right click on pipe network, go to edit feature settings. Down here, you'll see the default profile label placement. And it is more than likely set to the middle of the structure. In my case, I want it to be the top. So I'm just going to set it to the top real fast and hit OK. You'll see no change because it does not dynamically edit the ones that are already there. So I am going to control Z and get rid of these labels. And now let's double check that that control Z didn't screw that up. which it did, <laughs> top of structure. And now we're going to label them again. Bam, I'm hooked to the top, just that easy. <clears throat> if you had a style that you wanted to hook to the bottom, conversely, all you do was change that. So in other instances, you may want a drag state. So I'm going to move this over here, turn off my F8 and hook it. And it looks like it's pointing to here when I want it to point to the top. Watch what happens as I move this around. You see how it's moving around the structure? And it almost always goes crazy on you when you want it at the top. See, I have to be on the opposite side or backwards or something like that. So I can place that one. And you think, okay, I've got it. I'm gonna slide it over and it does it again. So what you want to do in order to trick this sucker is you're going to add a vertex. And then you're going to take and move this to where you want it to be. Let's say I want it over here. Now I can pull this up and around. It is very painful to do. Yeah. Whoops, wrong click. Let's add another vertex. And maybe I can tweak it now. I mean, you see how painful this is. Trick is, is that once it's there, you've got to toggle the pin. Now I can pull this over here and remove, I can retalk build the pin and now if I remove these leaders click the minus icon minus icon I'm back to where I want to it's very convoluted going around your and make sure you repin this thing once you're done so that whenever you uh, if you refresh anything it doesn't move the leader around that's two quick and easy things to help with labeling your profiles if you found this helpful please click the like button feel free to subscribe